The surgery was a success. Yeah. After chemo, Jeff should be cancer-free. Congrats. Yeah. Your family has a future. Uh, I look mad handsome, don't I? I know I could be a better husband. Stop. I honestly don't know if I can get over you cheating. <laughs> What's funny? You trying to convince me that I cheated on you after brain surgery is funny. With who? <laughs> White girl, student, looks like she owns a crystal shop in Santa Fe. You serious? You're serious? You're serious? You're serious? You're serious. Dead ass serious, bro. I don't know what you're talking about. I love you so much. I couldn't even, like, I couldn't even think about cheating on you. <laughs> I hate you so much. <laughs> Jeff is lying. I had this exact storyline on General Hospital. Look, the surgeon says that short-term memory loss is normal after brain surgery. How can I leave a man that doesn't even remember what he's done? What's that? I took the kids shopping. So by lingerie? Don't worry, what I got your daughters is totally tasteful. They're children. What, did you want me to help them with their homework or something? Yes! Oh. <sighs> who's Thelma and who's Louise? <sighs> Aren't you supposed to be in rehab? Scholar, coach bag, long story. I had to get out of Montana. I'm in the papers. I'm basically a circus animal. So you felt totally comfy as a black woman in Montana until this week? Dead. Whatever. Huh? Thought you could use some company. So all y'all ring doorbells, but none of y'all call ahead. <laughs> hey, Naomi, what are you doing? What's up? Sure, whatever. Boys got some good news. Oh, the old squad's here. You're dead, but I'm gonna deal with you in a minute. Uh. Because I got us a show, San Diego Four. Oh, uh-uh. Who wants to go back there? I agree to one show. My kids, my family, that's my priority. You need to find your independence. Jeff obviously wasn't thinking about you and he was calling some white girl a queen in your bed. Um, can you shut up? You talk so much without knowing a damn thing. You used to be a badass woman. Honestly, this is hard to watch. Guess what? I grew up. If you had a family, you'd understand. Messed up, you know it. Yo, the whole damn world saw what I saw last week. And the four of you on stage together, there's nothing like it. I think I'm done with this business. What? I want it. Twist? No, I gave my true self to an audience for the first time and no one judged. This is our second chance at friendship, at finding our voices. I mean, how can we pass that up? I just want you to be happy. I guess someone has to pay the bills. But we cannot do this show without you. The nasty bitches don't exist without you.